sa truth naman yun mo. Kasi yun ako conscious ako. Matutulog Hindi. Hindi ka din matutulog. My name is Irish and welcome to my channel. Kung bago ka sa channel ko, well, ano pa bang iniintay mo? Pwedeng pwede kang mag-subscribe at i-click mo na rin yung bell button beside it for notifications. For today's video guys, I will be trying out yung sikat na mabilis na pampapayat daw. Walang exercise, walang diet, basta consistent mo lang siyang iinumin. Well, alam kong alam yun na rin to. Well, you are correct, guys. It has something to do with chia seeds. So, marami na nga akong mga videos na napapanood na ganito, guys, na sobrang effective daw sa kanila yung chia seeds. So, in 7 days lang daw, guys, ah, yes, guys, 7 days lang daw, meron ka na talagang makikita ang observation sa katawan mo by consistently drinking this mixture. Though, meron din ako mga napanood na hindi nila tinuloy or hindi naging successful yung pag-inom nila nito. Kasi parang hindi sa kanila hiyang to. So, I think guys, it's very important for you to know and understand na hindi porket nag-work sa iba, eh mag-work din sa inyo. Or hindi porket na pumayat si ganito dahil ginagawa or iniinom niya to, eh gagawin niyo na rin at ipipilit niyo na rin. So, you have to listen as well to your body, to the reaction of your body kasi each, each one of us is different. So, ito guys, yung binili ko isang pack siya. So, dito sa Dubai, mabibili siya dun sa organic section ng Carry4 or any supermarket na may organic section. Pero guys, dun sa West Zone, nakabili din ako ng sale. Ito siya. Ito yung gagamitin natin for today. Two dirhams lang yung pagkakabili ko nito, guys. Ayan. Tapos, nakasashay siya. Ayan, nakasashay siya. So, I think ang gagawin ko for this challenge is... Itong isang buong to is ilalagay ko siya dun sa mixture na gagawin ko for today. Okay? So, for today's video, guys, ang gagawin natin is yung 1 to 2 weeks na chia seeds challenge. Bakit ko ba sinabing 1 to 2 weeks? Bakit, Irish, hindi mo nalang sabihin, isipin mo talaga kung ano gusto mo, 1 week ba, 2 weeks ba? Guys, ganito kasi yun. Marami ako mga napanood na nag-work sa kanila yung chia seeds na yes, pumayat sila in just 7 days and all. Pero madami din kasi akong napanood na hindi to nag-work sa kanila. Tipo, ang sakit ng ulo nila, nahihilo sila, nanghihina sila, and also, gusto kong i-limit yung sarili ko into like minimum 7 days kung anong magiging effect sa body ko, whether positive or negative. Siyempre guys, pag negative, stop tayo sa 7 days. Kasi parang alam mo yun, in 7 days, hindi siya nag-work sa'yo. So, kailangan ko na kayong bigyan ng aking update or status kung ano bang sa tingin ko ang effect sa akin ng chia seeds by using it or by drinking it in 7 days. Pero kung positive naman siya, sa tingin ko okay siya sa katawan ko, hindi naman ako nagkakaroon ng any other allergic reactions or any other reactions, then ipaproceed natin siya sa 2 weeks. Okay? So, chia seeds, guys, kasi is considered superfoods. So, pag superfoods ba, anong ibig sabihin nito? plant-based siya. So, alam naman natin, guys, laging sinasabi sa atin ng ating mga magulang or mga nakakatanda sa atin na anything related sa plants is healthy. So, given na yun, guys. So, since plant-based nga itong chia seeds na to, then we are only expecting nothing but nutritional benefits for this product. So, ano bang i-expect natin sa pag-take natin ng chia seeds? So, for long term, guys, itong chia seeds daw is good for you kasi nagdi-decrease niya yung sugar levels mo at yung cholesterol levels mo sa katawan mo. Another long term effects daw for chia seeds is yung sa bones natin kasi mataas to sa calcium as well as yung dental health natin, mas mag improve din daw siya. At nag improve daw to ng digestive health. So, sa mga constipated, baka pwede nyo ma-observe kung how is your bowel movement. Kung dati ba 3 days, nagiging 2 days na lang ba, o nag-daily ba kayo just by taking this. So, yun yung mga tipong long term na i-expect nyo for chia seeds. Pero in 1 to 2 weeks, ano ba yung pwede nating ma-measure na na-excite talaga ka ng bonggang bongga So, sabi nila, nag improve daw yung chia seeds ng mood mo at saka yung 
yung sleeping patterns mo. So, yun guys, medyo measurable yun at mabilis nyo siyang check whether may improvement ba talaga siya sa current patterns nyo or wala. For me, wala naman ako masyadong problem sa tulog or, you know, sleeping patterns ko. Okay naman yung tulog ko at saka maaga din naman akong nagigising. Tapos, apart from that, yung medyo excited talaga ako is yung nag-clear daw siya ng skin. So, Medyo mahirap yun yung measure pero I think kung lagi mong tinitingnan yung sarili mo sa salamin, mas makapansin mo kung nagbabrighten ba yung skin mo or nagkiklear ba yung skin mo, mas glowy ba yung skin mo. So, yun yung mga i-expect natin. At ang pinaka-importante sa lahat is nakakapagpapayat daw siya. <laughs> so, yun yung pinaka-excited talaga ako guys. So, yan pwedeng-pwede natin ma-measure yan. Kasi, syempre, from day one mo, ano ba yung weight mo, and then tingnan mo after 7 days, and after 2 weeks, ganyan. So, malalaman natin kung talagang mag-work ba sa aking weight loss ang chia seeds or hindi. So, Iris, chia seeds ka ng chia seeds. Ano bang gagawin namin dyan? Lalaklaki na ba namin yan para pumuyat kami and all? So, guys, ganito yon So, marami ko mga napanood na videos, iba't iba yung concoction. <laughs> iba't iba yung mixture nila ng chia seeds. Pero I think ito yung meron kasi ako um, dito sa aking pantry or the, <laughs> taray, or di, mer, ito kasi yung meron ako and I think ito yung mga naniniwala din ako mga products na okay sa akin, nag-work din sa akin at pwedeng pwede ko siyang inumin even with an empty stomach. So ito guys, bali meron dalawang mixture tayong pwedeng gawin dito. Yung first mixture is yung iinumin mo every morning with an empty stomach. Yung tipong pagising na pagising mo guys, yun na talaga agad ang iinumin mo. So yun yung first mixture na gagawin natin. And then yung second mixture natin guys is yung pwede mong pang everyday na iinumin, pwede mo siyang ihalo sa juice mo, sa water mo, sa coffee mo, and also, yun yung gagawin natin for today. So, start tayo yung sa morning drink natin. Again, guys, ang recommended daw nila tong gawin is with an empty stomach. And, ito guys, hindi ko sinasabi na ito lahat, gawin nyo talaga ito lahat, ha? Siyempre, nasa sa inyo yun, kung meron kayo, go. Kung wala, just work with, you know, whatever you have currently. Parang hindi na kayo gagastos. So guys, for the morning mixture, ito yung mga ingredients na gagamitin natin. So I have here water. Siguro mga nasa 3 fourths cup to ng water. And then, depende yun sa inyo guys ha. Hindi ko sinasabi na Bible nyo to, na talagang dapat ganitong ganito. Ito lang yung sa tingin ko na amount of water na kaya kong intake that early bago ako mag-coffee. Okay? Next is meron tayong apple cider vinegar. And then, meron din tayong cinnamon powder. Guys, this is optional ha, kung gusto niyo lang. And then, of course, chia seeds. And then, optional also is yung lemon. Tapos, syempre, ito yung glass na gagamitin ko for today. Meron lang akong teaspoon. So, para makita niyo sa clear yung glass na ginamit ko. So, start tayo. Kuha ko ng isang sachet ng chia seeds. Ito. And kung wala kayo ng mga ganitong type ng chia seeds na naka-individually pack na siya, ang um, pwede nyong gamitin is at least 1 tablespoon. And then next, yung cinnamon. Guys, yung cinnamon, pwede lang siyang gamitin sa morning ha. Kung yung normal water or yung normal mixture nyo, no need to put cinnamon. And then, actually for this one, parang pinch lang yung kailangan yung ilagay. So, I'll be putting a little lang. Ganyan lang ka konti. Lalagay ko. And then, after, ayan, squeeze lang tayo ng lemon. So, siguro mga nasa 1 tablespoon. And, yung apple cider vinegar natin, at least 1 tablespoon din. After that, ilalagay ko na tong water ko. But, ito na siya. Tapos, haluin ko lang siya. So, guys, ganito na siya. Yan. So, siguro yung iba ang hindi nagugustuhan yung itsura niya. Pero, healthy daw siya, guys. Tapos, mapuform siya ng mga jelly-like texture kasi i-absorb nung chia seeds yung water. 
So, para maka-hydrate yung chia seeds, guys, ma-absorb niya yung water, lalaki siya. Usually daw lumalaki siya. Kasi maliit lang yung chia seeds, guys, eh. As in, super liit lang niya. So, parang lalaki siya ng mga around 12 to 15 times. And, ililive lang natin to ng mga 15 to 20 minutes until ma-absorb ng chia seeds yung water. So, instead of waiting, guys, I suggest maligo kayo after yung maligo sa kanya siya inamin. So, yun ang gagawin natin, guys. Babalikan ka to at babalikan ko kayo pagkaligo ko. One eternity later. So hi guys, I'm back. So after 20 minutes, ito na yung itsura ng ating mixture. As you can see, parang ang dumi-dumi niya, diba? Parang hindi talaga siya kaaya-ayang inumin, tingnan, ganyan. Pero tingnan natin kung ano bang lasa talaga niya. First time ko to guys, ha? first time ko makakatikim siguro ng chia seeds. Yung ganito, Unless siguro yung mga desserts na nilagyan nila ng chia seeds na hindi ko alam. First time yung ganito na matitikman ko. So, let's see. Not bad. Parang wala lang. Kung hindi mo siya makikita ganyan, okay siya. Nag-glide lang siya sa lalamunan mo as normal as water. Para siya may jelly-jelly feeling. Yeah. Tapos pag kinagat-kagat mo siya, para ka lang kumagat ng peanut. Siguro na maliit na maliit. Parang ganun. But so far, okay. Hindi siya yung kakaibang feeling na icky feeling. Okay siya. Okay naman yung feeling ko sa kanya. So, syempre, nalalasahan ko yung cinnamon, lemon, tsaka apple cider vinegar dito. Hmm. As easy as that. So, ganun lang siya kadaling inumin. Hindi siya yung struggle. Inumay na parang ayaw mo and all. Okay lang siya. Para ka lang umiinom or para ka lang yung mga gelatin-gelatin. Yung gelatin nga makakain mo pa eh. Ito hindi mo siya talaga kailangan uyain. Inumin mo na lang siya. Lunokin mo na lang siya. Okay lang siya. And yeah, I think I enjoyed that first cup of my chia seeds mixture. So definitely, itutuloy pa rin natin siya. Itatry natin ng itatry hanggat kaya ng katawan natin ng, ano mo yun, kung wala tayong allergic reaction and all, itutuloy natin siya. So, yun guys, yung ating first mixture, yung ating morning mixture. Yung second mixture natin, madali lang actually, same lang, chia seeds lang, tapos water. So, pwede nyo siyang i-overnight para mas jelly-jelly-ish siya. And then, the next day, pwede nyo siyang gamitin. Yung entire mixture na yun guys can last you for 5 days. So, pwede kang mag-imbak ng isang picture and then isalin-salin mo siya sa iba't ibang jug, iba't ibang mug for the entire 5 days. So, ito yun guys. And then, dito na tayo kukuha ng ating mixture. Tapos guys, sa isang picture, I will take 1 8 cup ng chia seeds. Dalawang ganda, guys. And then, lalagyan natin siya ng water. So, ito, guys. Nilagyan ko muna ng half ng water. Tingnan natin kung anong mangyayari. Pag na-absorb niya agad lahat, and then magdadagdag na lang tayo ng water. So, for this one, ilalagay ko na lang to sa ref. Tapos, as I've mentioned, isasalin-salin ko na lang siya. Like, for coffee, pwede niyo siya ilagay sa coffee. Or, yung normal drinking water niyo, maglagay lang kayo siguro ng portion or juice, pwede nyo rin siyang ilagay. Tea, pwede nyo rin siyang ilagay. So, ito yung mixture ko, guys. Yung for water or for daily consumption, ilalagay ko lang siya sa ref. Okay? So, that's it for today. Magsicheck in lang ako in the coming days. Balitaan ko kayo. Um, update ko kayo kung ano na ba ang nararamdaman ko sa sarili ko. At kung ano na ba yung pakiramdam ko dito sa Chia Seeds Challenge ko nito. Wish me luck! Bye!
day two. Hi guys, good morning. I woke up like this new vlog today. Pero just sharing with you na ito yung aking day two ng aking chia seeds challenge. Day three. Hi guys! Third day ng ating Shia Seed Challenge. See you tomorrow! Day four. Good morning! Day three ng Shia Seeds Challenge. See you tomorrow! The next day. Hi guys, good morning. It's day 5 ng aking Chia Seeds Challenge. See you tomorrow! The next day. Hi guys, it's my day six sa aking chia seeds challenge. Um, alam niyo guys, wala naman ako ng uh, experience na something different talaga. Hindi naman siya yung parang napapansin ko na hindi ako hiyang ganyan, hindi naman ganon. Pero feeling ko lang ang bloated ko. Feeling ko bloated. Hindi ko alam kung bakit. Hindi ko feel na pumapayat ako. Yun yung nararamdaman ko. Pero okay naman yung pakiramdam ko. Sa katawan ko, walang headaches and all. Pero hindi ko feel na pumapayat. So yun lang ha. In my 6 days, yan yung observation ko. Pero never pa ako nag-weigh in. So, maling naman natin, ba? Anyways. Lemon. See you tomorrow! The next day. Good morning! Today is the seventh day ng ating Chia Seeds Challenge. And guys, yung major observation ko sa kanya while doing this challenge for a week now is yung sa bowel movement. Medyo constipated kasi talaga ako guys eh. So tipo mga three days, ganyan norm yan sa akin. Pero, for the last 7 days, medyo nag everyday ako na poops. Sorry, TMI. Sobrang important and healthy pag nag discharge ka everyday. Or nag poops ka everyday. See you tomorrow! The next day. Hi guys, good morning. Today is the eighth day ng ating chia seeds challenge. See you tomorrow! The next day. Hi guys! Good morning! Today is the ninth day ng ating Chia Seeds Challenge. See you tomorrow! The next day. Hi guys! Good morning! Welcome sa ating 10th 
and last day para sa ating chia seeds challenge. Sorry, mahina pa po sa sinaan to. And guys, dinadagdagan ko ito ha. Nagdadagdag ako ng chia seeds and water at least every night. So next, sasabihin ko na sa inyo ang aking final thoughts para sa challenge na. Hi guys! So I'm back sa aking final thoughts with my 10 days chia seeds challenge. So gaya nung nasabi ko sa earlier part ng video na to, merong mga kiniklaim to sa chia seeds na mamimeasure lang natin siya long term. At syempre, meron din naman yung mga short term na benefits. So dun nga sa mga long term, nandun is yung mapapababa daw niya yung cholesterol at saka yung sugar levels mo. And since mataas sa calcium yung chia seeds, yung bones mo daw is magiging stronger. And yung dental health mo daw magiging on point. Though, for the past days kasi, medyo may carrot factor yung ipin ko. Na hindi ko naman sinasabi na dapat pinatibay or dapat hindi ko yung naramdaman dahil ng chia seeds ako. Yun lang naman yung quick observation ko for the last 10 days. Tapos guys, doon naman tayo sa short term benefits kasi doon ako very excited na i-share siya sa inyo. So first is yung nag improve daw yung mood mo. Um, ang napansin ko lang is hindi hindi masyadong masakit yung ulo ko lately. I mean, yung migraine kasi sa akin is quite common. So, for the last 10 days, parang wala naman ako masyadong migraine. Never akong uminom ng migraine pill ko as far as I can remember for the last few days. So, that's one. Yung mood, siguro dapat si Sachi yung tanongin natin kung may nabago ba sa mood ko habang iniinom ko or habang ginagawa ko tong challenge na to. And then, second short-term benefit is yung nagki-clear daw yung skin. Hindi ko naman sure kasi, I mean, for me, maganda na hindi ako nag-break out just because of doing this challenge. So, that's basically it. Pero yung nag-clear, hindi ko din sure kasi nga, syempre, meron din naman akong ginagawa on my own, like yung skincare ko, and also, I'm not, hindi ko alam kung talagang because of that is medyo may improvement pa yung skin ko. And then next, short-term benefit daw is weight loss. So, alam ko, excited kayong malaman. Um, to be quite honest, hindi siya yung payat na payat for me. I lost at least 2 kilos in taking chia seeds for the last 10 days. Si chia seeds ba ang sisisihin ko dahil pumayat ako ng 10 days? Hindi ko rin masabi kasi hindi rin naman ako masyadong nagkakain ng kanin. Alam mo yun, nagliless naman ako ng carbs as much as I can. So, hindi ko talaga masisisi si chia seeds about it. But one thing na I can share with you is that, alam nyo na for the last couple of weeks, is nagtatry out ako ng Valentus Coffee. And probably, if I will compare the two products that I've tested, like drinking Valentus Coffee for one month and taking chia seeds for 10 days, I can say na similar lang yung na-lose ko na weight by taking these two products. I mean, hindi ko sila sinasabi yung apple-to-apple comparison na parang mas bongga ba si chia seeds and all. I think in general lang is yung nangyari sa akin with this, with this challenge is that parang in, in, in overall, mas kaya kong i- lifestyle si chia seeds than Valentus coffee. I mean, this is just my personal experience, okay? Don't get me wrong, guys, ha? And to be quite fair as well with Valentus coffee, guys, nung iniinom ko din talaga siya, parang hinayaan ko lang din, hindi ako talaga yung nagda-diet, hindi ako nag exercise and all. I'm just taking it as my usual coffee like I always do, like my morning coffee. So, Yun, yun lang naman yung quick comparison na masasabi ko. Um, it's not really a detailed comparison, but, you know, a general comparison between the two. Okay? So, that's for the weight loss. And I think the weight loss of chia seeds will go to the fact na yung fourth short-term benefits niya is about your digestion. Kasi, and I think ito yung 
apart from, you know, nag-lose ako ng weight, more important sa akin is yung sa digestion na sobra ko talagang napansin while taking these chia seeds. Kasi, kung hindi niya na itatanong, guys, I'm constipated. At least three days bago ako mag-poop, ganyan. Pero, with this challenge, guys, at least every day akong nagpo-poop. Sorry, TMI, but I'm just really sharing it with you all kung ano yung na-experience ko in this challenge, okay? So, yes, daily akong nagpo-poop and may time span na twice for that 10 days, ha? So, ayun. So, yun yung sobrang takeaway ko sa challenge na to. Yun yung sa mga challenge ko, eh, um, within myself na hindi ako frequent with that with my bowel movement and I'm so happy na with this na regularize na yung poop ko and if you are going to ask me kung Irish are you going to continue drinking um, chia seeds mixture and be part of your lifestyle straight answer is yes and to be quite honest with you I'm filming this video almost a week after yung first 10 days ko and I'm still drinking it so Apart from this one pala guys, yung morning mixture, every morning sa office nagdadala ko nung parang at least small cup ng chia seeds and water mixture ko. Tapos nilalagay ko yun sa water ko or sa coffee ko pag nagko-coffee ako sa office. Also guys pala, with the chia seeds, nalesen yung pag-inom ko ng coffee kasi before, usually at least 2 to 3 cups of coffee ako. At least ngayon, once a day na lang akong nagko-coffee. Which for me, I know there are good benefits of coffee. Um, but I believe still na everything that we do should always be in moderation. So yun lang guys. Sana nakatulong itong quick review ng pagawa ko sa Chia Seeds Challenge. And, and if you have questions, just put it in the comment section below. Sana you enjoyed this video guys and give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!